the Russian. The Russian is a specific variation of a two-in-one hand control of wrestling, i.e. two of my hands controlling one of my opponent's hands. At first glance, this position translates poorly to MMA. I mean, honestly, my opponent can just punch me with his free hand. But I think with the right use, there's some merit to it. For example, we saw John Jones use this type of hand fighting with a lot of success against Glover Teixeira. So the Russian can help you get a strong angle on your opponent and it sets up a ton of takedown. Here I show a couple of my favorite simple ones that work well together. Once I take the Russian, I reinforce it and I use that for a snap down. And then I use that snap down to lead into my simple high single off of my opponent's reaction. Especially with the snap down, a big key is transferring your weight and pulling in a straight line, not in a circle. Against the cage, the Russian can be effective for pressuring your opponent, and although, as I said before, there are openings for him to throw punches, you'll have some opportunity to deliver damage as well. I'll be the first to admit I'm not an expert in the striking arts. We should probably get Jack Slack or Lawrence Kenshin to weigh in on the striking opportunities from the Russian but I think there's a lot of good positional advantages that can be presented and a lot of good takedowns that we can use off the Russian in MMA.